In this video, we will explore two more props supported by flat list component, the list header component and the list footer component. They allow you to add custom header and footer components to your lists. Let's start with a custom header. The prop is list header component and this accepts a React component and renders it at the top of the list. It's perfect for adding titles, descriptions, or any other content you want to display above your list items. Let's add a simple text component that says Pokemon list with style set to styles.header text. Let's go to our styles section and define the styles. We're going to set font size of 24, text align center, and a bottom margin of 12. If we now change data to Pokemon list once again, and take a look at the UI, we can see the text Pokemon list at the top. On similar lines, the list footer component prop accepts a React component and renders it at the bottom of the list. This can be used for adding footnotes, pagination controls, or simply a message indicating the end of the list. Once again, let's keep this simple and add a text component that says end of list. Let's also add style is equal to styles.footer text and define the styles. Font size 24, text align center, and this time margin top set to 12. If we now take a look at the UI, scroll all the way to the bottom of the list, we can see the text end of list. Whether you're displaying a catalog of products, a collection of articles, or a list of Pokemon, both these props can help you create more engaging and user-friendly interfaces. Alright, thank you for watching. Please do consider subscribing to the channel and I'll see you in the next video.